Welcome to the Reset to Zero Challenge and Accountability. Let me get Instagram going here. And there we go. Okay. So Reset to Zero Challenge and Accountability. All right. For those of you that know, I have been going live on YouTube every day. Today was day 38. I do reseller reflections at the end of every day. Um, here at consignment shots from my e-basement. And one of the things I talk about is reset to zero. <clears throat> reset to zero. What that means to me is that my desk is totally cleaned off before I go upstairs and go to bed. Things are set up for the next day and everything, everything is cleaned off. There's no extraneous stuff around. And somebody brought up to me today in masterminds like, that's not what reset to zero would mean to them. So they didn't want to be challenged. So every day when I do my reseller reflections, I call um, I call out the people that have committed to do this with me to clear off their workspace and, and get it ready to go for the next morning. And uh, one of the members said, well, I don't really reset. I, I have a lot of stuff going on. Like I have stuff that I'm in the middle of listing. I have stuff that, you know, is lined up for the next day. So my desk isn't clear. All right, so reset to zero is not necessarily that your desk is clear. Like that's what it means to me. But when you reset to zero, it means that things are lined up for you the next morning, whether that means a you know totally clear workspace, whether that means you have your listings lined up on your desk and the things that you're gonna accomplish the next day. It means that there is no to-do list there. There is no sticky note there that has that doesn't have a place there, right? Like if you've already done that and you don't need that note, it's put away, it's recycled, it's thrown away, it's it's not on your desk. Um, there, there's nothing that has been completed. There's no inventory on your desk that you've already that you've already done. You've already finished listing. Like if you're an online reseller, if you've already finished listing it, that needs to be put away. Not the stuff that you plan on working on. Um, the next time. So reset to zero can look really different for everyone, but it's been so helpful for so many of us uh, to do that. And just the concept behind like walking in and being ready the next day is so important. Um, it changes your whole perspective in the morning. Like instead of think about like walking into a clean desk or things that nothing that needs to be done from yesterday, Think about waking up that way and that's the way you start your day. Way different than I've used my, so every Thursday night, hey, Samantha, yes, whatever you can do to reset and be the most productive the next day, that is absolutely right. Yes. Um, like I've used my I, Thursday nights, I do a live sale and Normally what it looked like at the end of my live sale, and I would leave it until the next morning, there would be stuff to be shipped. There would, it looked like things were just thrown, you know, all over. It definitely was not reset to zero. And I would wake up every Friday morning, like, and I've posted pictures of this online. Like, I can't believe I have to deal with this. And it, it just, it, it just ruined Friday morning for me. It just made me feel, you know, unproductive and unsuccessful from the moment I got up. Terrible. So since I've taken the reset to zero challenge um, that Jill, you know, kind of put out there, rusted truck relics. Thanks, Jill. Um, I've been doing that on, on Thursday night after my sale. It gets all cleaned up. It gets shipped. It gets done. And let me tell you, my Friday mornings are beautiful now. Huge change. All right. So if you want to be called out, on my reseller reflections and be accountable with me. Let me know. Yes. <laughs> yes, I did. I'm doing another live uh, right after reseller reflections. So I wanted to talk about reset to zero challenge and accountability. So if you want to join and you are in, want to be in the reset to zero challenge club, I will call you out every day. We will chat about it and you will be way more productive and your mornings will be much better. So right now I have Jill of Rusted Truck, Truck Relics, Jason, Santi Swapper, Mr. C Chats, Molly's husband, Nick, Kathy of Kathy Sings, Char of Fabulous Flamingos, and Vanessa of Brightest Holidays. So 
Do you want to be added to that list? Let me know because you guys are crushing it. And your days, I know, are so much better because you reset to zero. All right, everybody, have a great night. And if you want to join the challenge, just let me know. Send me a message, pop it in the comments, and we'll be on this ride together. All right, bye.